This is gonna be an insane challenge with massive risk. So we wanna know if a car or a truck can get down the Red Bull Hardline mountain quicker than a downhill bike. Jackson Goldstone last year did the Hardline course in two minutes and 20 seconds. Goldstone yeah. is gonna go fast despite a massive margin. Look at the time. It's a mile long with 400 meters of elevation but I can say from experience that the Land Rovers that drive you to the top take forever. The route goes back and forth. It's almost four miles long. I timed them. It's about 14, 14 minutes. 14 minutes. So for you to do that in two minutes, 20 seconds, you're going to have to be going like eight to 10 times faster, right? Talk me through the rumble. If, if, if anything can do it, the rumble can do it. So this is full stadium track. This thing's top speed, top set about 170 kilometers an hour. You but jump it. It does mean jumps. We've got massive Toyo tyres, the thing is super lightweight, it's less than 800 kgs. What does it rev to? Uh, to the moon. <laughs> like 11,000 RPM, she just screams. I feel like this is like, this is motocross with a roll cage. You got your freaking handles here, Thank mate? you. Yeah. Do I need to know about the fire situation? No, you're good, you just switch, you just get out, I'll sort everything else out if that happens. So. <laughs> I'll get out. Enjoy, mate. Thank you. <laughs> Ready when you are. Okay. <laughs> Mechanical wheels hanging off. You guys hear me over? Yeah, Matt, we're, Matt, we're on it. Don't worry, we're on it. We're on it. There should be a wheel there. <laughs> so we came around that corner, and Mike just kind of backed off the power because he wasn't getting drive. The entire wheel had snapped off at that, like shattered off at the hub. The brake rotors shattered. It's like a massive mechanical. And we all kind of picked up the back of the car to get the wheel out. It was folded flat. But the first thing Mike said, really, after realising, was thank God that happened in that slow corner while we were warming up and not on one of the fast mountain road cliff edges. Because as it collapsed, we would have rolled off a mountain. So like he, in his head, established that that's a good thing, that it's happened now, because we have been tumbling down a mountain. But as a passenger, I can't... I can't describe how loud it is. I'm gonna to have to get earplugs because I'll, or I have to tap out. It's the loudest thing I've ever experienced. It it hurts inside my brain. I got hit by a puddle so hard the water got behind my goggles, you know. <laughs> and we've only been in it two minutes, so I cannot. If that thing gets running again, this is gonna be the greatest video. But right now, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. All right, mate. Like I'm sat in the bar. <laughs> Better luck this time, eh? Yeah. We've got probably the worst this is... weather conditions, but... Yeah, let's leave it a week, we'll fix the truck, the weather's going to be better. Nah, <laughs> just send it.
the bell with eight, it's about five percent. No way you're it's, in control. It's, it's, it's Feels like there's no way you're in control of fifty percent of it. <laughs> Maybe 70% of it. <laughs> that truck is so unbelievably fast. Mikey and that truck combined are something else. He's just driving so pinned, but it's not enough. We timed some of the sections today and combined it's not actually going to be quick enough and it's so frustrating because the weather's been bad, but tomorrow it looks just as bad again and there's riders on track. But this task as a whole means way more to me now than it did when we set up the challenge because technically with me in the passenger seat, I could be the fastest mountain bike rider down hard line and that's like... That's bragging rights I can't afford to miss because that's never ever going to happen on my bike. So we're just scanning now looking for shortcuts because some of these roads we're going to need to cut off some sections. We end up so far away from where the track is, it, we're driving in the wrong direction. If I can find some shortcuts here, I'm going to tell everyone how fast I got down this hill and I'm going to make them listen. So it's a long night. 20 minutes, somehow we've got to cut into 2 minutes. Well, less than 220 anyway, if we want Maddie to be the fastest downhill mountain bike run down Red Bull Hardline. So that's it would be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> that's a challenge. You could pin in every section, but linking it together is going to be could, tough. You could claim it without even riding it. <laughs> Let's do this, bro. Fire up. Yes, Mikey! Woo! <laughs> 